If you look outside tonight, the moon is brighter and closer than usual. This is a live look from just outside of CBS 8 studios in Kearney Mesa. That's beautiful. We saw a super moon at the start of the month and tonight a rare super moon, a super blue moon to end it. As CBS 8's Regina Yurita has more on the celestial phenomenon and why this is such a big deal, Regina. Well, guys, this is rare. Blue supermoons are very rare. The last time we saw one was back in 2018. They usually happen every 10 years. Now, the moon is not the only thing you'll be able to see tonight. You can also see Saturn at its closest and brightest near the moon. Sky watchers tell me they're excited to see this lunar cycle that happens once in a blue moon. Tonight, a rare phenomenon is being seen all over the world. The second full moon of this month looking bigger and brighter from Earth. So it's a super full blue moon. Greg Howdigy, who studied geophysics, says don't expect the full moon to turn blue. August brought two full moons, making it a super moon. But on top of that, tonight's full moon is also closer to Earth than normal, which is also considered a blue moon. The orbit around the Earth is not a perfect circle. It's a bit of an oval, right? It's like an ellipse. So there's points when the moon is closest to Earth and there's points when it's further away from Earth. The rarity of it all has people fascinated to look up at the sky tonight. To me, it's just, I have to go see it. But those looking to observe the moon from a beach should consider checking conditions first. Forecasters say the close proximity of the moon could mean the range of tides might be stronger than normal. The first supermoon earlier this month brought flooding in Mission Bay. Whether you're watching from a telescope or with a naked eye, the blue supermoon will appear vivid for the next three nights. And NASA says two supermoons could happen in January and March of 2027. That's four years from now, only reminding us that these rare phenomenons are beautiful, but they don't happen every day, so it's best to catch this while we can, right? Absolutely. <laughs> I'm going to go outside right now. Okay, go. <laughs> it's beautiful out there. I gotta go check yeah, it out. Yeah, I did I catch it on my way back from dinner break. We it, was, did. it was beautiful. I feel like a lot of people think like, oh, we're gonna we can watch it during our telescope, but like you can capture a nice picture on your phone yeah. or anything. It doesn't have to be like this professional lens. It, it's so close, it's beautiful.